Deep present Primary Mathematics for Standard 6 Pupils. Today, our topic is on Reciprocals of Numbers. Welcome to the program. Hello, Standard 6 Pupils. Today, we are going to learn about Reciprocals of Numbers. With me in the studio are two Standard 6 radio pupils, Edith and Simon. Edith and Simon, say hello to Standard 6 pupils. Hello, hello pupils. pupils. And I am your radio teacher. We are going to start by talking about reciprocal of a whole number. Class, what is 3 divided by 3? Give the answer to your teacher now. Good. Edith, what is 3 divided by 3? Three? 3 divided by 3 is equal to 1. That is correct, Edith. Class, did you get the correct answer? Good. 3 divided by 3 is equal to 1. Simon, how do we write 3 divided by 3 as a fraction? We write 3 divided by 3 as 3 thirds. Good, Simon. 3 divided by 3 as a fraction is 3 thirds. This fraction is expressed as a product of a whole number and a fraction. Teacher, write on the chalkboard 3 divided by 3 is equal to 3 multiplied by a third, which is equal to 3 thirds. Edith, what is the fraction 3 thirds? The fraction 3 thirds is equivalent to one whole. That is good, Edith. The fraction 3 thirds is equivalent to one whole. It means that 3 thirds is equal to 1. Class, what is 7 multiplied by 1 seventh? Give the answer to your teacher now. Thank you. Simon, what is 7 multiplied by 1 seventh? 7 multiplied by 1 seventh is equal to 7 seventh, which is equivalent to 1. Well done, Simon. Class, did you get the correct answer? Good. 7 multiplied by 1 seventh is equal to 7 sevenths, which is equivalent to 1. Now, class, what is 30 multiplied by 1 thirtieth? Give the answer to your teacher now. Thank you. Edith, what is your answer? 30 multiplied by 1 thirtieth is equal to 1. Good, Edith. Class, I hope you got the correct answer. 30 multiplied by 1 thirtieth is equal to 30 30th, which is equivalent to 1. Teacher, write the following on the chalkboard. 3 multiplied by 1 third is equal to 1. 7 multiplied by 1 seventh is equal to 1. And 30 multiplied by 1 thirtieth is equal to 1. Thank you, teacher. Simon, what do you notice about the products of the problems we have worked out? The products of the problems worked out are all equal to 1. That is a correct observation, Simon. The products of all the problems we have worked out are all equal to 1. Class, any two numbers whose product is 1 are called reciprocals. Reciprocals. Teacher, write the word reciprocal on the chalkboard. 
reciprocal spelt R E C I P R O C A L reciprocal the number which when multiplied by a whole number and gives a product of 1 is the reciprocal of the whole number Edith what is the reciprocal of 3 the reciprocal of 3 is 1 third that is correct Edith the reciprocal of 3 is 1 third class what is the reciprocal of 7 tell the answer to your teacher now Thank you. Simon, what is the reciprocal of 7? The reciprocal of 7 is 1 seventh. That is correct, Simon. Class, did you say that 1 seventh is the reciprocal of 7? Good. The reciprocal of 7 is 1 seventh. Class, what is the reciprocal of 12? Give the answer to your teacher now. What is the reciprocal of 12, Edith? The reciprocal of 12 is 1 twelfth. Well done, Edith. Class, I hope you got 1 twelfth as the reciprocal of 12. To find the reciprocal of 12, we look for a number which, when multiplied by 12, will give a product of 1. This number is 1 twelfth because 12 multiplied by 1 twelfth is equal to 1. Therefore, the reciprocal of 12 is 1 twelfth. Teacher, write the following on the chalkboard. 1 third is the reciprocal of 3. 1 seventh is the reciprocal of 7. And 1 twelfth is the reciprocal of 12. Thank you, teacher. Class, the reciprocal of a whole number is the fraction whose numerator is 1 and the denominator is that number. Simon, do you have a question? Yes, teacher. Is the reciprocal of one third equal to 3? That is a good question, Simon. It is true that the reciprocal of a third is equal to 3. The reciprocal of a fraction whose numerator is 1 is a whole number which is also the denominator of that fraction. Class, what is the reciprocal of 1 eighth? Give the answer to your teacher now. Edith, what is the reciprocal of 1 eighth? The reciprocal of 1 eighth is 8. That is correct, Edith. Class, I hope you got the correct answer. Teacher, write the following on the chalkboard. 1 third is the reciprocal of 3. And 3 is the reciprocal of 1 third. 1 eighth is the reciprocal of 8. And 8 is the reciprocal of 1 eighth. Thank you, teacher. Let us now find the reciprocal of a fraction whose numerator is greater than 1. For example, what is the reciprocal of 2 thirds? Simon, how do we find that? We find the number which when multiplied by two-thirds 
give a product of 1. That is correct, Simon. We need to find a number which, when multiplied by 2 thirds, gets us a product of 1. The fraction 2 thirds is the same as 2 multiplied by 1 third. Edith, what is the reciprocal of 2 and reciprocal of 1 third? The reciprocal of 2 is 1 half and the reciprocal of 1 third is 3. Well done, Edith. The reciprocal of 2 is 1 half and that of a third is 3. The fraction 2 thirds is the product of 2 multiplied by a third. Its reciprocal is the product of the reciprocals of 2 and the reciprocal of a third. Simon, what is the product of the reciprocals of two and a third? The product is three halves. Well done, Simon. We multiply the reciprocal of two, which is a half, by the reciprocal of one third, which is three, to get the product as three halves. Class, what is the product of two thirds and three halves? Give the answer to your teacher now. Thank you, class. Edith, what is your answer? The answer is 1. Good, Edith. Class, I hope you got the correct answer as 1. When we multiply 2 thirds by 3 halves, we get 6 sixths, which is equivalent to 1. Simon, what is the reciprocal of 2 thirds? The reciprocal of 2 thirds is 3 halves. That is correct, Simon. The reciprocal of two-thirds is three-halves. Teacher, write the following on the chalkboard. Three-halves is the reciprocal of two-thirds. And two-thirds is the reciprocal of three-halves. Thank you, teacher. Edith, what can you say about a fraction and its reciprocal? The fraction and its reciprocal have the same numbers. The numerator in the fraction is the denominator in the reciprocal, and the denominator in the fraction is the numerator in the reciprocal. That is an intelligent observation, Edith. Looking at the fraction and its reciprocal, we find that the reciprocal is obtained by interchanging the numerator and the denominator of the fraction. Class, what is the reciprocal of four-fifths? Give the answer to your teacher now. Thank you, class. Simon, what is the reciprocal of four-fifths? The reciprocal of four-fifths is five-quarters. That is correct, Simon. Class, I hope you got five-quarters as the reciprocal of four-fifths. The fraction four-fifths has the numerator four and denominator as five. Therefore, its reciprocal will have its numerator as five and the denominator as four. Class, what is the reciprocal of 12 sevenths? Give the answer to your teacher now. Thank you, class. Edith, what is your answer? The reciprocal of 12 sevenths is 7 twelfths. That is very good, Edith. Class, I hope you said 7 twelfth is the reciprocal of 12 sevenths. The fraction has the numerator 12 and the denominator 7. So, its reciprocal 
will have the numerator 7 and the denominator 12. Therefore, the reciprocal of 12 sevenths is 7 twelfths. Class, what is the reciprocal of the mixed number 3 and 2 fifths? Work that out and give the answer to your teacher now. Thank you, class. Simon, what is the first step of finding the reciprocal of 3 and 2 fifths? The first step is to convert the mixed number 3 and 2 fifths into an improper fraction. That is correct, Simon. Class, did you first convert the mixed fraction into an improper fraction? Good. Edith, what is 3 and 2 fifths? as an improper fraction? The mixed number 3 and 2 fifths is the same as 17 fifths. That is correct, Edith. The mixed number 3 and 2 fifths converts to 17 fifths, which is an improper fraction. Simon, what is therefore the reciprocal of 3 and 2 fifths? The reciprocal of 3 and 2 fifths is 5 17 Good, Simon. Class, I hope you got the reciprocal of 3 and 2 fifths as 5 seventeenth. The mixed number 3 and 2 fifths becomes 17 fifths. The reciprocal of 3 and 2 fifths is that of its improper fraction 17 fifths, which is 5 seventeenths. Class, what is the reciprocal of 5 and 3 thirteenths? Work that out and give the answer to your teacher now. Thank you, class. Edith, give us your answer. The reciprocal of 5 and 3 thirteenths is 13 sixty-eighths. Good, Edith. Class, I hope you got the correct answer. We first change 5 and 3 thirteenths into an improper fraction, which is 